Oh, it's, I love working out here. Willie Gray is one of the 800 people who landed a job with the big Fresno Fair. It was like a blessing for me to get hired here because it's like the economy is still bad when, when it comes to jobs. So out of those 5,000 people who showed up at the job fair, what made Willie stand out? The best thing about that gentleman is he was well-dressed. He was extremely prepared. He had his resume. He had copies of the application. He articulated himself extremely well, and he knew what he wanted when he came in. Lori King, deputy manager of the fair, says Gray did everything right, including acing his interview, which is considered to be a huge factor in getting a job. Because you're, you're seeing the, the people that are, are interviewing you and they're seeing you and you're making an impression on them in person. It doesn't matter if you're interviewing for a landscaping position or a manager's job. The process can be nerve-wracking. Just ask any of the people attending this interview skills workshop as Central Valley Professionals, a job club for out-of-work professionals. It's very helpful just to practice interviewing because a lot of times I become very nervous in interviewing. Lorraine Shinnenfield, who had an interview later that day, is practicing a method called the STAR technique. STAR stands for situation, task, action, and results. Shinnenfield says remembering those four words can help you answer some of the most common questions asked during an interview. Because it gives a quantified way of doing it. You have a problem and you solve that problem and you tell the results. And that's the most impressive way to give an answer to a question. Questions like describe the worst problem you've had at work and tell how you resolved it. A lot of people call them trick questions. They're actually behavioral, designed to give employers an idea of how you will handle future situations. Because what you've done at the previous job is going to show them your attitude and your actions on your new job. And Willie Gray is working hard to make a good impression on his new employer. He'd like to continue working for the fair. I'm really thankful for the position that they gave me and I'm looking forward to coming back next year if they will allow me to. Juanita Stevenson, ABC 30 Action News.